Yes indeed, new camera. I come to you now in glorious 16x9 high definition widescreen, so that now you too can witness for yourself just how awful my skin is. Anyway, do you remember this guy? I don't know if anyone else knows, but he showed up last May for about five seconds and then disappeared completely, only to reappear absolutely bloody everywhere in enormous quantities at half price, just in time for Christmas! Anyway, I know I said ages ago that I'd review him soon, but frankly, I can't be bothered. So here's a guy who did a similar thing, Chekgar Retgar! Yeah, this guy ticks the big and handsome boxes better than most. He's got that brilliant, smooth, inflated look going on. He is one chunky junkie on. Yeah, this guy's got a ton of presents. He's one of the few animated voyagers that's not too small or too skinny. He's just right. He's just like, BAM! This does mean that you can't quite reenact the scene where he rides on Lugnut's back, but that's hardly Retgar's fault. Observe his massive head up here. It's like a TV and a suitcase had a fling with the king of all cosmos. Facial hair there? How does that work on a robot? And how long has it been since I've been able to say with any confidence at all, LOAD PIPING! His arms are kinda alright, I mean they're not quite as poseable as I would've liked, but he's more than capable of giving you a good thump on the bounce Or a nice big wave. Hello! I love his legs too, they're like big, delicious, rounded off slices of red Lester. And check out the pneumatic detail on his torso there, I'm quite into that. You've got this wicked gimmick called TIENE BRASSOS DE ELEVACION! Which I'm assuming is the pop-out energy blade dealies. Alright, so you can put them like this, or like this, either's good. So yeah, that's all the good stuff. Now for the bad stuff. It's not really bad stuff, it's more like one bad thing. Honestly, what the hell? What is this? This is ridiculous. It reaches the floor. It's as big as he is. I know when I was talking about Energon Barricade, I said, Who cares what's on somebody's back anyway? But that guy's a combiner. His backpack forms Bruticus's tits. This has no other purpose. Lazy. This is appalling. You can make him stand on his alt mode. And it's such a shame, because the bits of the robot that are actually a robot are really nice, but they only count for about 50% of it. For shame! Transformation's a bit of a letdown as well, because most of it's done for you. I mean, yeah, you fold away all the arms and the legs and everything, but then you just cover everything up with the backpack. Boring, but it does make for a pretty nice alt mode. It's nice and substantial, but also cute and round. Certainly works a lot better than some other backpack fiends. Check out his little forks here. You can like lift them up so we could empty your bin into his bed, if he had a bed. And you can even do some alt mode melee combat. A Bowie beyond mini bong, baby. Yeah. A rare thing indeed. So yeah, I really don't want to say this thing's crap, because it isn't. It's a charming, striking, explosion of a bot with a really cute and kind of cool alt mode. But the backpack, oh the backpack. I don't know why, but this time it's different. I mean, at least with Darkwind you can kind of go, <laughs> that sucks and it's funny. But with Retgar, it's not the same. It's too much. It just sucks. So take these words, Retgar, and know that I'm not mad at you. I'm just disappointed. So yes, big thanks to the folks who clubbed together to get me my sweet new equipment. That's Captain Britain, Brickinator, Osmatar, and several anonymous donors. I'm off to get a hundred makeovers.